I have an exam tomorrow and it's gonna be for wildlife nutrition. So right now I'm just having some dinner. I'm eating butter chicken, which is actually so delicious. I never had butter chicken until I tried it at school. And I'm happy I did because it's so good, even though it's a little spice. Yesterday I finished my wildlife nutrition exam and talked to one of my program counselors about possibly taking some summer courses and I've confirmed that this summer I'll be taking two courses, a computer course and a course about honeybees. So that will be interesting and if all goes according to plan, it's going to be worth it to take those two extra courses. But now I'm going to go on the GO bus to go back to my hometown and go to my high school to go watch a music concert that my brother happens to be in and it's also my music teacher one of my favorite teachers in high school it's going to be his last concert because he's retiring so oh, it's gonna be so nice to see him again and see some of my old classmates so hopefully things go well and I'm excited to hear what songs they have to play this year I'm back in my usual room and it is so messy I know I'm sorry it's gonna be even messier when I bring all my stuff back from my dorm room once I move out usually whenever I come back here there's like random stuff on my table that my parents leave and I found this little box it says Hotel Nico Saigon oh I think that's from Vietnam let's see what's in here Ooh. Fancy chocolate. Let's try it. The music concert starts at 7 and goes until 9 p.m. And right now it is 5.21. So I still have some time. I might go a little bit early to see if I can find any of my old friends. <laughs> going to be taking all of this apart and sending it back home with my mom because next week on Tuesday I have to move out and it's gonna be a lot of stuff that we have to stuff in the van so I'm going to lighten the load right now by taking away the living area and I think I'll also send my mini fridge back and the monitor but I wanted to show you a quick little house tour before I have to demolish all of this so let's take a look at my room so I live in room number five in this townhouse and the first thing you'll notice is this cool little chill area that I set up with my guitar and over here is kind of my snack shelf where I have lots of little goodies here and all my binders and old books. This section is by far my favorite part because I get to play my guitar here sometimes, read a book on the chair, and also I have these really cool grids that I used some command hooks to put onto the wall. And I have my DIY Polaroids on here, my letter board, and some perler beads up there. I also got this cool lamp from Walmart and it really matches with everything else. Here I got my BTS poster from Love Yourself Answer. And this is a wardrobe that comes with the dorm room. It holds all of my hoodies. Then I have some lotions and stuff here. Keep my laundry basket up here. This is where I sleep. Usually I don't make the bed to be honest. But this is what it looks like when it is made. I have a monitor here that is connected to a Wii U so that I can watch YouTube videos through my Wii U or play Mario Kart. 
more BTS posters. In back chair that's always super comfy. This is where I usually film my talking parts. I'll usually put my camera like down here and then you'll see me talking in front of my chair. And then back here I have my iMac and some extra lighting. My school library also gives out these really handy calendars that you can fill up with all your important dates. So I have it for all four months. If I didn't have the extra lighting, this is what the nook will look like. It's really dark in there, so that's why I have the extra lamp and then my desk lamps here. How it works is that all of the lights are connected to this, which you can just step on this button and then everything is turned on except for the LED and you just and that is how I set up my workspace. I'll do a much better room tour on the main channel but this is kind of overall what the place looks like. If you go outside of the room there's this extra storage room and here is where I usually take off my jacket, take off my sneakers and I have a mini fridge that has yogurts and some quick cool snacks. Down the hallway we have another room that used to be inhabited by one of my friends but then she moved out so now it's just empty in here and I can be as loud as I want in my room and then I Here's another storage area, and here I kept some of my toner cartridges in an empty box. Turning to the left, we have the shower. This is a really different shower compared to the one downstairs that has a bathtub. And then here, this is the bathroom. And then this is one of the roommates who just moved out recently. Um, no one's ever used this storage area, but it's a huge empty space. And there's a hole that leads up to the roof. And then we go down a flight of stairs to the second floor. This roommate moved out today, but I think she forgot to lock her door. So this is what her room looked like. This is like a standard dorm room size. So this is the another one facing the road. And there are two windows in this kind. Pretty cool. She got this tiny little window. I'm guessing she forgot that you need to lock it before you move out, so I'll just lock it for her. This is her shower. See, it has like a bathtub. And now let's go to the first floor. This is our little kitchen. I don't usually cook a lot, but it is pretty nice to have this stove and oven. This is my pot. And I brought the microwave. For people who do like to cook, it's pretty spacious. And I think a lot of people would love to live here in the townhouse. Now over here, this is supposed to be a sitting area, but nobody really uses it. And there's a, a window here that looks out onto the road and the gym. I got my shoes and this is where we usually come in the front door. Another area that we don't really use is this living room. It's also, again, very spacious. I don't really hang out in here. I usually just lie on the couch whenever I'm waiting for whatever I'm cooking in there to finish. So well, that is pretty much it for the first floor. Yeah, so just a quick little house tour. It's pretty nice to have three floors. The past two dorms that I lived in were only two floors because the first thing that you do when you open the front door is go up a flight of stairs. But this is a three floor townhouse, which is probably my favorite townhouse so far.
All right, now we are a little bit emptier. I'm gonna miss my nice soft white chair. A little bit of self-care this evening. Well, that was a fun two days back home to see my music teacher's last spring concert before he retires. It was also my brother's last concert since he's graduating high school this year. Now it is time to study for my disorders exam, which is on Monday. Wish me luck. <laughs> I can show people I have friends. Yes, yes, I'm a friend. <laughs> what did you learn? That's the yeah. drumming. Wow. Yeah.